today we are at Leytonstone tube station and we are going on a tour of St. East London indie bookshops. Very excited. I've picked out a couple and we're going to visit all of them and take you guys along. Hi everyone, I'm Lucy from the Book Bell. Um, yeah, can't wait to see all the bookshops. So we've ended up somewhere next to like the highway good. and the and tube, but we've got some nice flowers and we're, we're going to make it there. Yeah. So now we've made it across London. Um, we went to All You Really Love, where we had some really nice like homemade it was rolls. Amazing, so yummy. They do like secondhand books and new books, and it's absolutely lovely. It's a bit of a trek, but I think it's really worth bit. going. It's worth it. Yeah, yeah, very very sweet. Now we're in Hackney. We're going to Pages of Hackney, which used to be sort of my local bookshop. Yeah. It's small but perfectly yeah. formed, and it's got the best editions of everything. Okay, let's go. What do you thought one book that I wanted to buy from the window? What is it's it? The Essex Serpent. It's like historical fiction I believe. That got recommended to me in a bookshop yesterday. Oh really? Yep. Oh well, there you go. I'm gonna buy it. The rain has stopped and right. <laughs> it was pretty Thank bad God. for a while. We're at uh, Broadway Bookshop, which is a little bit dark to film inside, but it is gorgeous. It's got really good non-fiction, a really interesting way of displaying books. Definitely, definitely. And if you're here on like a Saturday, there's the Broadway Market, which is awesome. You can Always go check plus. out. All right, so we're taking the touristy route. We're walking past the canal. It's so actually pretty. really lovely now that it's stopped raining. And the next bookshop is only like a 15 minute walk yeah. away. Do so, that. Let's go. So that was Burley Fisher Books. We just met Fisher? Yeah. Is it Fisher? The Fisher. Fisher, the Burley Fisher. <laughs> exactly. Um, really good for personal recommendations. Really open, clean. Really um, spacious, yeah. So lovely. Bought good a new book as well. So uh, definitely hit it up as well. We are now just next to Brick Lane. We went to the Brick Lane Bookshop, which I love. And we're now sitting right across from Libraria, which was the final stop. I, yeah, it's such a glamorous, very glamorous shop It's like a, a brand it's new nice. bookshop. It's yeah. very dimly lit inside, but it's like really high mm. shelves and really it's, nice. it's good. So that brings the East London Independent Bookshop tour to an end. But Yay. we're gonna also show you which books we got. Oh yeah. Okay, so I had some books in mind that I really wanted to buy and luckily I found both of them. One of them was The Essex Serpent by Sarah Perry. This is kind of like a mythological historical fiction book about an Essex serpent, believe it or not. And the second one is Girl Up by Laura Bates. Good choice. Is the founder of the Everyday Sexism Project and I've heard amazing things about this. I really want to read it so I'm so happy that I've found it and can read it now. So. 
pretty happy with my choices. Good haul. Okay, so the first one I got is the Vegetarian, which recently won the um, Man Booker International Prize. It's been on my list for forever, so I'm gonna check that out. And then at Burley Fisher, I bought So Sad Today. Again, that had been on my list for a while, and I tried to find it at several of the shops, uh, and ended up finding it there. So those are the two ones that I got. Okay, so that marks the end of our East London Independent Bookshop video. All information about bookshops and books will be in the description, Hello. and uh, a link to Lisa's channel, of course. And that is it. Bye! Bye.